as you seen earlier in the vlog i took you guys along with me as me and the hubs went to a brunch spot to eat and it was so nice like this place was so quaint it was so super cute um it was a local spot it was black owned absolutely loved it when i tell you they had so many unique um brunch options they did um also into the lunch hour because um they closed i think maybe roughly like three or four o'clock p.m which is perfect um just wanted to get some brunch for me and him uh this was on saturday instead of sunday uh father's day today is father's day he's actually gone to the barbershop and then after we're supposed to go and see a movie but right now y'all i am painting yes i am painting this is the time for home improvement so i am doing that um while listening to me an audiobook um i'm i'm listening to in the woods or something like that so i'll pop it in i'm into it and not into it have you guys gotten into it let me know um but that's what i'm listening to while i'm painting i'm going to show you my project really quickly um what i'm working on and the sanding and everything is just driving me nuts i work on two projects actually my office and also my room painting um but that's what i'm doing right now because i'll have to stop that shortly then get ready so we can go to a matinee with the kids and all that so let me just show you really quickly and i hope to all the fathers i hope you're having a wonderful father's day and let me just show you what i'm working on so this is what i'm working on as you see it i have to do some sanding I'm really close here but i have to do some sanding to this wall and i am having a rough time i've patched up quite a few um repairs in the room but this is what i have to sand down and get together and so i can paint because i'm going to start with the ceilings first but i feel like i just want to sand this out because this was the last like little spot patch that i had to do in the room but it's kind of huge as you can see so that can be already sanded so when i get to the wall you know i could just get that going but this is what it's looking like and yeah this is what i'm doing today if you're working on any projects i don't know let me know how that's going for you and if you have any tips for me so this is me spot doing a few things here <laughs> i just had to show you guys like i got started with some stuff and then like yeah it is just i start stop start stop start stop yeah that type of deal i had to get back on here really quickly <laughs> i sanded down that like so good oh my goodness it is so smooth i'm so proud of myself i just had to um <laughs> show you guys i did such a good job it was looking so lumpy but it is super like smooth now and i am so proud of myself see if i stick with it i can get it done and there's nothing that i feel like i can't do maybe i'll sand here a little bit because it's a little still rough but i did such a good job the paint is going to be so good but it's been a minute since i have been able to get back on here and talk to you guys um after painting i didn't end the vlog properly at all after painting because i thought i was going to get back on um and vlog a little bit more but i didn't get an opportunity to so i am reading another book well not reading but listening to another book i'll put it here and um this book is i can't i don't know why i can't think of the name of it but this book is so good um it is basically about um um, I think it's either two women or one. I think it's two women that open up a breakfast, a bed and breakfast. And this place is like, they revamp it. They get it from, I think a relative and then they revamp it. Um, but it is so good. And 
right when the two women are opening up this opening up this bed and breakfast um a murder happens on the actual property the opening day and it is getting really good i'm excited to get more into it and i did not know it's going to be this good um but i'm really into it it has a lot of twists and turns past come into play and all of that but it has some mystery into it and um I'm really enjoying it. It was something that I kind of just like a any mini mighty mo type of pick type of deal because I was having a hard time and struggling with figuring out what to read next. Um, I kind of wanted a love story, but I really couldn't find what I wanted. So I stumbled across this one and then I completed that. Um, did I complete anything else? Oh, I'm not even really sure. But if I remember, I'll just pop it up because my memory sometimes like, but for, truthfully, like I can get into maybe two books at a time. So when I'm like going back and recalling books and things like that, it's like super, super annoying because I can't remember because I might be into two books. So yeah, that part. Um, after work today, I think I will go home and unwind i probably might be get back on here just to talk a little bit more um to you guys but didn't have a lot to say um, um but i did want to get back on and kind of give you um an insight on what's going on work so work is uh, very slow i'm so happy i am a um, counselor at a college and it is super slow right now but we're still getting students in but it's not as hectic as it would be during i don't even want to say traditional times but during like a fall or a um, spring semester where it seems like it's very very busy um summertime is normally like a lot slower only because i feel that um students are taking the summer off some of them so it is um, a little slower than normal which is really good and um it gets you um gives you a pause in between students in that but yeah um, my commute was really good um, around about this time commute to work is pretty good because a lot of people are going on vacation or taking a vacay so they're not traveling going to work or working from home Back in my favorite section. Yay. These are so bomb. I truly recommend 10 out of 10. They are fully stocked too at Target. I think this is the one that I have. Love it. to get back on here when I got home but I wanted to get on here now um, so maybe I can give you guys a glimpse of what will be at the bridal shower um, so yeah I wanted to do that really quickly and then um, I'll get back on here when I get there it is super hot so I know you guys probably can't hear me so I'm going to get off of here until I get to my location see you soon
prosperity, and all the blessings for this marriage, upcoming marriage to be. We are proud of you. We love you. And more specifically, honor God with money. And yeah. we're going to see this here. Honor God with money because this was a thing with Jacob. <laughs> It has been a long week for me. I didn't properly get a chance to end the vlog, but I wanted to end it here. Y'all, this week was a doozy, like from work, issues, situations happening. Y'all, I got rid of my whole car and got another car. It's been a whole process. Like, when I tell y'all it's been a whole process, it has been a whole process. So, I've been super duper, like, busy. Like, busy, busy. And I was like, I need to get on here and properly end this vlog. But I want to show you guys, too. So, <clears throat> we are putting together a baby shower at the workplace. And, y'all... I went out today and I found the most cutest thing. Would y'all look at this? It's a little robe for the baby. Are you kidding me? And then too, so I also found this thing here. And this has like the uh, headband with the wristbands because I wanted wristbands because I knew um, when, cause I do, I have a headband already, but this is a matching set. So I was like, perfect. And it's cheaper than just buying the wristbands alone. Like the price of this, I think was like $4.99 or whatever. And it was cheaper to get this like this than just to buy the wristband separately. So I was like, you know what? Just buy the whole entire set. But yeah, so I want to get on here and just recap a little bit. A little bit of the bridal shower um, on there. And um, it was a really good time. Uh, the bride was very gracious and grateful and it was a good time and um, a beautiful setup um, despite everything that happened to me I was still able to attend and get there so that was great you know what when I all I want to say to you guys before I really end this um, God is good and even through your hard times if you just keep the faith things will work out so you just have to keep the faith at the end of the day and everything will work out um so that's what i wanted to say but until next time the next video i'll have probably a, I, i'm getting ready to take a trip and i wanted to put some of that in here but it's already long enough i've already prolonged it long enough for the vlog and i didn't want to do that so I'm going to, the next video will be me packing, getting ready to go, and how I pack for a trip. That should be very interesting. So if you have not, please subscribe, like, share the video, give me a thumbs up. That really helps the channel out. It doesn't cost you anything. And until the next time, I'll see you on the next video. Um, and bye.